Welcome to another video by your surely Sahil Bora. We're going to be talking about namespaces in the C++ language. So what are namespaces? Namespace, you may, when, when we're starting to learn C++ programming, you may notice that common line using called using namespace std. And the reason why we use this line using namespace std is because we want to access all the functions and libraries of the C++ language. Especially when we're just starting out, because we don't want to have to, we don't have to want to declare std every single time we want to use the library. So that's why we use that line using namespace std. But when you get when you get to more advanced levels of learning the C++ programming language, you may not want to use that line using namespace std because we just want to access maybe one or two functions of it. When you get to the late, when you get when you get to the, the, the later stage of using the C++ language in the advanced levels, but the reason why we mainly use name we we use namespaces is because we want to avoid naming conflicts in our advanced C++ programs. Now, namespaces is some is is an advanced topic in C++. So, if you're a complete beginner to to using uh, to to using namespaces. Then I don't recommend you starting with starting out starting out with namespaces as a beginner. But when you're in that intermediate advanced stages, I do recommend that you you read along and understand what namespaces are because they are very useful in in, in advanced programming concepts. But going back to but going back to namespaces, let's say for example that we have two classes and that they both use they both have the same name. Let's say in the example they're both called Overflow. And in, the, in this example, we have two classes with the same name called Overflow, and we, we both try to compile them at the same time. But the problem with using both of those both of those names at the same time is that the compiler isn't going to know which 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 class to use, which is going to lead to conflicts by using the same class at the same time. So how can we solve this problem? The way that we can solve this problem is by using namespaces. So by using namespaces, what we can do is that when we have when we have a separate namespace with the same class name, by using by using a different namespace, say for example in this in this example that I've got below, namespace one and namespace two, but we can use this, but we can use the same class name. This will solve the problem by not having to by not having any compiler issues of trying to use the same class name, whereas by not using namespaces. Do you see what I mean? By, by using namespaces, we can use the same class name, but when we, compi but we, can, when we compile the code, we're, we're not going to have any, any naming conflicts of which, of which class that we're going to use. So, so that's the advantage of using namespaces, to avoid naming conflicts of when we're running, trying to run two classes or two functions of the same name. So I hope that made a lot of sense, guys. If you have any more questions below, please feel, feel free to comment down below and I'd be more than happy to help you guys out. I hope you guys enjoyed my latest video. As you know, I'm always giving you something new, but what I'd like for you to do is that I would like for you to click on the link below and sign up for my free report on the five major tips to shorten and accelerate your learning curve in a matter of months. This free report is the report that I wish I had when I first started learning programming back in 2009 and it would have saved me all the time and frustration it took me to start understanding programming. It's yours completely for free and just scroll down below, click on the link and just sign up for the free report today. This is Sahil Bora reporting out.